Yes, Alpha's gonna give me another spanking, it seems. So yeah, here I am up against Alpha Leopard, the man himself. You guys should check out his stream on twitch.tv slash alpha leopard. He's um, doing some playthroughs of all the campaigns, I believe, as well as pretty much all the endgame content. Um, yeah, so thanks for doing that, man. It's, a, it's always nice to get a bit of an addition to the uh, content creators, especially when, yeah, you do have a bit of pull. You know the titles, which is always cool. Nice to see what else, you know, what other streamers are up to in, you know, other games. Not necessarily the big end of town, like, I don't really have time for, like, all the big, big, huge streamers already. Like, they've made their fucking money. Or are making it, you know. It's time to breed the next gen. And hopefully it will bring a bit better gameplay too, because like honestly, surely people have got to get sick of Battle Royale games. Surely. And that's why you control cycle hotkeys, guys. It might look like mindless spamming, but most of the time, even when Carnage and PF2K are doing it at 700 APM, they're actually checking um, timers on things, queue timers, all sorts of things. Like, it just helps to be sort of really active and all that. Like, I've you don't necessarily have to play the safest gameplay every game if you know you've got really, really sharp mechanics. And it's sort of aware on what can happen around the map at a particular moment. What the hell are you doing there? A lot of it all just comes down to experience. Like people say it's it's all just down to macro, but honestly, like, what does that actually mean to a lot of people? That's that's a whole field of different things from minimizing being housed to keeping workers in production, keeping military in production, gathering as effectively as possible, spending as effectively as possible. There is there's several different skills that, that can actually be broken down to and which ones people actually need to work on at a given time might actually vary. And there's always the thing of priorities as well, you know. You've got to know what you're up against a lot of the time. And, you know, it's easier for the more experienced players because they've, they've read players with similar styles. You know, it's not rocket science. And I've got no idea if there is even another hunt over my side of the map. Huh? I'm literally going to take the one up here. Okay. So I'm going to do that. Take a fairly quick warship. I've got the spar barrier to defend at home at this point in time. I don't even need that. Actually, I might as well take it because it's pretty early in the game. I'm going to be fairly late on my town centre, but to make up for it, I'm going double dock. I'm going to be able to get chisel. Actually, I might not be able to. Just 
Sure. Good job, Good. Okay, the fuck is all the power of my side of I 
Here, I'll free up the population slot for him. <laughs> Don't even need to go that far. Surely I built another stables, didn't I? Go, 
I think I've got all the fishy. Time to age up. I have all the resources in the world. I'm way behind on my upgrades. Yeah. Yeah. 
Soldier. Soldier up! Atish! Okay, go to each other. We're running, running pretty low on resources by now. Mm -hmm. Oh shit, I'm gotcha. running out of gold.
Just give him fucking ninety. down here for all I know. You never resign. Okay. 